Good morning. I'm Teresa Shaw, and thank you for joining me for devotions this morning. You know, um, everybody's getting excited. We're getting closer and closer to Christmas, and the excitement is on, and we have um, lots of cooking to do, presents to wrap, and we're excited. Well, today, I'd like to read from What on Earth Am I Here For? And it is by Rick Warren. And uh, it's the reason for everything. It's all for God. Everything that we do is for God. I know we think that it's not, but it really is. Uh, Not only were we created by God, you were created for him too. The ultimate goal of the universe is to show the glory of God. It is the reason for everything that exists, including you. God made it all for his glory. And without God's glory, there would be nothing. What is the glory of God? It is who God is. It is his nature. There would be nothing. Where is the glory of God? Just look around you. Everything is created by God and reflects his glory in some way. We see it everywhere from the most uh, microscopic form of life to the vast Milky Way. From sunset and the stars and the storms and the seasons, creation reveals our creator's glory. You can learn a lot from God's character. Just by uh, looking at all that is around you. Through nature, we learn that God is powerful, that he enjoys variety, loves beauty, is powerful, and he enjoys variety and is wise and creative. The Bible says, the heavens declare the glory of God. How can you know what God is really like? Throughout history, God has revealed his glory to people in different settings, but God's clearest picture of what he really is like is seen in his son, Jesus Christ. The Bible says, in the past, God spoke through the prophets many times and in many different ways, but now he has spoken through the son, his son. The sun reflects the glory of God and shows exactly what God is like. Well, I just hope that you enjoy those words and know that God depends on you and that he loves you and he needs you to do his will. May God continue to bless you. Please have a wonderful Christmas. And I look forward to seeing you again. I'm Teresa Shaw.